Hello everyone. So today Jackson and I are heading out to the first helmet race of the series for this year. I just pulled him out of his stall and he is currently eating his Inflame Away Daily Golden's American Family Feed. Um, I just wanted to get some of the supplements in him, especially the joint supplement before we went. And then he'll get the rest of his grain tonight. We will also be using the Redmond Gold Tube again. I really liked the uh, results from last week when we used it. So we're gonna use it again today. So we're just gonna get them cleaned up really fast. First I wanted to show you guys. So I did some upgrading to my saddle. So first of all, this is my new saddle. Um, well, new to me. And I put some new conchos on it. I ordered these. And then I got some of the stirrup, stirrup stickers for my new stirrups. And then I had a little fun, so I decided to try decorating my own conchos. So I added those onto my bridle. And then I put some fringe up here. And then I also did the same to my breast collar. So he will be rocking that tonight. So let's go ahead and get him groomed up. All right, so I just kind of wanted to share one of my little hacks with you guys. Say hi, Jackson. So I use a spray liniment, so it's just a liquid liniment, uh, a liquid liniment mixed with water in a spray bottle. And I spray down where the saddle sits and his legs before I wrap them, just so they stay cool under there and he doesn't overheat. I figured I'd really quick share some of my favorite products right now. So like I said earlier, I'm really loving the Redmond Daily Gold Stress Relief Paste before a race. He does really well on it. This will be our second time using it. I'm hoping to see as much of a difference as I did last week. I'm also really loving the Cowboy Magic Super Body Shine. And then I use the Vetrolin Liquid Liniment mixed with water. And my favorite is the Naughty Horse Concentrated Detangler. It smells so good. So I'm not sure if anyone's noticed, but I do use polos on Jackson's back end for races. So I'm a big fan of polos. I feel like they get a more custom fit to the leg. They support the tendon as long as they're wrapped correctly. And I have spent lots of time practicing my wrapping. So I do wrap his back end with polos. Hi, Bubby. Hello. So I do wrap his back end with polos because that's where all of his power is coming from during competition runs. He drives to his hind end, so I really want to protect those tendons. I do use sports medicine boots in the front. Yes, their front legs and their back legs are equally as important as, as important, but I do feel like the back boots don't fit him quite as good as the front boots fit him, so I always wrap his back legs just to make sure he's still getting that extra support.
Shit. Now push, push. Nice run, 16.060. Hello guys, so we just finished our run and we're heading back home. We're just like a couple blocks from the arena. So, yeah, it's really freaking cold out here for uh, Southern California. It's in the low 40s, high 30s right now. It's gonna get down to freezing tonight, so everyone's gotta bundle up. We did pretty good, not our fastest, but he's still out of shape. We almost took down the third barrel, but it stayed up, thankfully. Um, right now, it look, it's looking like we might get some 3D money, so it was pretty good for his first big race back. I believe there was like 126 people entered, they said. So we'll see where we end up. So we are home. I'm just going to get Jackson untacked. I'm going to untack him, spray him them liniment, put his blankie on, and then get, them, get him the rest of his dinner. Yeah, were you a good boy? Good boys get treats. Good boys get treats. You dropped one. Jackson loves apple smacks. They're his favorite. 